Hello and welcome to this integration development video from Anapav Trainings. My name is Simon and I will take you through this demonstration on SAP Travel Request Workflow Integration on. In this video we will demonstrate you the workflow development for SAP Fiori Travel and Request Management. When an employee create travel request in SAP Fiori Standard Application, the request will be sent to the manager. The manager will also receive a notification email for the travel request on his mailbox. Manager will then go to my inbox, Fiori application which is a standard Fiori application for approving all the workflow requests. And after evaluation, approve or reject the travel request created by employee. Once manager approves the request, a notification email will be triggered to the employer for the approval intimation. Also an email notification needs to be sent to the higher authority for example, HR or finance. This customer requirement cannot be created by standard SAP workflow. Hence, Anapav Training have developed a custom workflow to cater to this requirement from the Fiori app. We have developed a custom workflow, which triggers the multiple email notifications on receive of a new travel request, as well as on approval and rejection of travel request. One unique feature of this workflow is to also intimate the concerned authority. Once the workflow is approved by manager, let's go ahead and see the demo. So, first we go and create a new travel of request for employee. Same employee goes and click on the plus button to create a new travel request in SAP system using Fiori app. So let's create a new travel request. The purpose of the request. Enter the start date and end date of the travel. Provide the country of travel, city, and the estimated cost. Also a note to an approval and creates the travel request. Once the requested is created, it will submit the request for approval. Please note the request number is 81. Click on Submit. Now you can see the travel request has been created. It has been sent as a work item to the manager for approval. And we go to the back end system in the workflow lock. You can see the work item is created and it's ready. At the same time, an email was triggered to the approval or approving the work item. You can see this is the email. Now the agent will take the action. Approval will take the action. And we'll be able to see all the requests which were created by their ordinates. Manager will select the request. We can see the request details, including the request number, which was 81 and finally manager approves the requests. The task has been successfully processed on the back end. When you go back, you will see and another email would have triggered. And notification is triggered to the requester. We'll see request has been approved. And another email was triggered to the concerned authority e informing them about that a manager has approved a leave request of an employee. The rules to find out concerned authority are maintained in a custom table according to the organization units. That was a quick demo on SAP Fiori Travel Request Workflow Integration. If you are looking forward for SAP Fiori development along with workflow integration, feel free to reach out to us on contact at anapavtraining.com and we will be happy to assist you. Thanks for watching.